Now, with Josh, I mean, he, we know him as a singer, and he has an amazing voice. Yeah. And he's dabbled with, you know, appearances here and there. But this was his, like, really first acting role. What was it like to kind of work alongside someone who's kind of a novice in this era, in arena? Yeah, well, he did star in Great Comet on Broadway, which I happened to see because I also worked with um, uh, the lead actor, the lead singer, actress in that. Uh, her name is Danae Benton. We worked together on Unreal. Um so when I made my way out here, I made sure to see it and was stunned by his acting performance as well as his voice, obviously. Yeah. Um, but I think he's, I think he just is kind of spe special. He just, he just gets it, yeah. you know? There was no, there was, there was no struggle. It wasn't like directors had to, you know, come in and really guide him I mean he just knew how to do the comedy like yeah. he just he just got it his his comedic sense is just really really refined already um I don't know I guess he's he's just like really gifted yeah it's yeah it's unfair I know of, honestly, like all these people I'm getting a little mad about yeah. it <laughs> <laughs> right like you could sing you could act what else like, can you do stop it <laughs> And I understand he does some, you guys do some singing throughout the, uh, the show as well. We saw Tony kind of belting it out yes. in there. Tony sings. Uh, they made me sing one line, which terrified me. And I was like, well, first of all, I don't think Cora is a good singer, so I'm going to sing it badly. That was my excuse. And then, um, and then I, I also was like, let's just like do a few takes where I just say it. Because I'm also like acting opposite Josh Groban, and I'm like, the idea of singing in front of you on camera is just terrifying. He was really sick that day, so it was fine. <laughs> um, but I'm also such a hypocrite because uh, when the cameras aren't rolling, I'm like singing things poorly, very loudly. <laughs> and uh, occasionally Josh Groban would come in and harmonize with me and I'm like, I don't deserve this. You really shouldn't be harmonizing my, my very crappy rendition of whatever song from Hamilton was in my mind that day. Uh, <laughs> But uh, but yeah, we had fun.